Yo, 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 what's going on, guys? It's Elizabeth Bourne making another video, and today I'm here to talk about the guide for when you start in type soul. So let's just get straight into it. So, as we start, basically, you're gonna spawn into the game and you're going to be a human. You're gonna be running around KT, but the first exact thing that you're gonna have to do is to die, whether it be by a hollow NPC or a player. You're gonna have to die. Now, as you die, you're gonna become something called a lost soul. When you're a lost soul, you're then allowed to pick what you wanna go out of the three races inside of the game. So, to become a hollow, as you're a lost soul, you're going to want to press Control K. Hear me, control K, do not press any other key. If you wanna go any other race, do not listen to people telling you to go press control K, only unless you wanna become a hollow. Now to become a Quincy as a low soul, you're gonna want to go around KT and look for a specific portal at XX10 and XX40 that has one blue side on the right and a one white side on the left. That is the Wanden gate and it's only open throughout those times for 10 minutes each. So you'll be able to go through it. As you spawn in, in the spot of Wanden, you're going to want to go directly the way that I'm showing you, directly through the path. And then it's basically just going to lead you to a statue that is there. A statue that asks you the question, I am the, I am a worshiper or I, like, I worship the king, something like that. But it's that specific NPC, you click on that, you click the prompt, and then you become a Quincy. Now how to become an SR. At the moment, there's only one way to become an SR, which is purification, but I asked the developers and they did come up with a new way, which is a Shinigami quest. It is added to become a Soul Reaper and that's it for the most part. I don't know it at the moment, but I will update you guys. But you know, yeah, basically for the most part, you gotta go up to someone who's a Soul Reaper and ask him to purify you. Um, I'm not sure how it's gonna be on release, but yeah, for the most part that is all of the ways how to get into each faction in type soul There are 10 essential ranks in the game that allow you to go from grade 5 to elite grade, which is the max rank and After that, you know, you're obviously gonna be max and able to go for your Bankai, Rez, or mode or whatever Shinigami as well, they have to actually get five categories of XP which consists of mission, division, shikai, player grips, and raid grips. For every other faction, it relies on three uh, categories of XP. Um, but yeah, it makes it unique because you know you actually have to have your shikai XP and your division XP to be more immersed into it. But that's that. Also, for Hollow Two, it's pretty self-explanatory. You have to spawn in before you actually have to do the missions and stuff. You have to be a Hollow kill other hollows and keep evolving until you eventually become a wrong card and that's when you consist of the you know xp and stuff you gotta go and rank up and all of that well that was basically it showed off everything that i needed to do in the guide not gonna really talk about too much about bankai and res because you know i'm not gonna say anything but you guys are obviously gonna have sources to do that because you know a lot of cc people are big lipped but that's fine it doesn't really matter i want you guys to just experience it and enjoy it yourselves for the most part, um, every single faction has their own weapons and tiers. I'm gonna just pop them on the screen, but that's just basically it. Uh, you know, I'm glad the journey we came, glad the game's finally out, and hope you guys can enjoy on release. Catch y'all in the next video. Peace.